We're having bacon hot dogs. Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. And you may notice that the car is loaded down. Today is a very special video. Today is the first video that I will be testing out the micro camper. Uh, I'll get to really sleep in this and stay in it all night. Chad and I, my best friend Chad, this is Chad. Uh, we are headed up towards Bethel. We're going to go up towards the Sunburst area. There's a couple of sites that I know of that you could pull a car right up to and stay. Uh, and we're going to go stay there for the night. One site is lower in the valley. I'm hoping we can get into that one because the other one will probably be freezing tonight. I mean, it's going to be freezing no matter where we go. Ooh, that sun is bright. It's going to be freezing no matter where we go because the low tonight is 26. No, 22. It's gotten colder since the last time I looked. I've got a couple of goals for this video. One is to obviously sleep in the uh, in here all night. I want to be able to cook dinner tonight. Uh, we're going to sleep, or I'm going to sleep all night. Chad's sleeping in his car. And we're also going to cook breakfast in the morning and... <laughs> Hopefully we just survive and don't freeze to death tonight, which I don't think we will. I've got a Sub-Zero sleeping bag and tons of blankets and I think it's going to be a good time. Fire and uh, beer and... Actually, dang it, I didn't bring any beer. <sighs> we'll still try to have a good time. up here still I think enough daylight to uh, to set everything up we've got a fire there we got our cars parked I think I think we might freeze to death tonight all right let's build a fire What's wrong with your bun, Chad? It's solid, it won't open. <laughs> I'm the only solid bun in the whole pack. Okay, it's actually not that cold in here. We've been sitting around the fire for the last, gee, I don't know. A while. It took us forever to get the fire going. We are calling it a night. It's been a pretty good night. Um, it is really nice that I don't have to get in a tent. I get to sleep not on the ground in a vehicle. It's not the warmest thing in the world, but I'm gonna be able to see the stars, see the moon, definitely. I think overall I've got my setup pretty dialed. I've got several blankets. Got my, my Star Wars blanket that blanket and I've got a uh, 20 I think it's good for 20 below sleeping bag that if I get really cold I can get in there uh, it's pretty warm in here surprisingly like it's cold because it's cold outside but compared to outside it's warm in here I did end up putting just these little covers I think when I get home I'm gonna make a cover that goes over the top window because that's letting out a lot of heat and I'm gonna need this again next weekend to when we go hunting. If you listen real quietly, you can hear the river way off in the distance. It's kind of peaceful. I'm gonna to try to go to sleep. I'll see you guys in the morning. Morning. 
Oh, it's cold. <laughs> There's ice on the windows. It's about, let's see. It's about 8 o'clock. I slept pretty good. Um, once I got under on my blankets, I, I did wake up at like, I think 1 o'clock, and I was freezing. So I got in my sleeping bag too under these blankets, and I was fine after that. My battery's about to die because it's so cold. Um, I think we're going to get up and try to get a fire going. we still got to get to finish this video. we still got a big breakfast. And I think that's it. We made dinner last night. We had hot dogs. We did that on the fire. We're going to make bacon and eggs for breakfast. I just realized I forgot to buy eggs. So we've got bacon and a couple hot dogs left. Yep. I got a, a pint of uh, whole milk if you want some milk with your bacon. <laughs> Packing it up. Uh, had all my, it got so cold last night. The, I took the drone up. The batteries in it died like instantly. Uh, the camera batteries died, and my phone batteries all died. Even my car battery was kind of low, which I'm kind of worried about. That I might need to get a new battery. How'd you sleep, Chad? Cold. I slept pretty good. I was surprised. Uh, yeah. Now we're gonna pack up and get out of here. Overall, though, I think it was a pretty successful little camping trip. And now my camper is a mess. Don't tell Chad, but I miss my family. I wish I had brought them instead of him.